It was only a few days ago that British health officials were saying a new virus related to SARS was not spreading between humans, but now their tone has changed. The first case of human-to-human -human transmission of coronavirus has been confirmed in the UK. The infection is a potentially fatal virus similar to SARS. It's the 11th confirmed case of a patient with a new coronavirus worldwide. The new virus was first identified last year in the Middle East. The 10 people who have previously been infected had traveled to Qatar, Saudi Arabia, Jordan and Pakistan. The latest patient is a UK resident who has not recently traveled to any of those countries, but did have close personal contact with an earlier case. The new coronavirus is part of a family of viruses that cause ailments, including the common cold and SARS. In 2003, a global outbreak of SARS killed around 800 people worldwide. But as the Health Protection Agency tells the BBC, the risk of infection is still considered very low. If the coronavirus was more infectious, we would have seen a larger number of cases by now. I think we need to be watchful at this stage, but there's certainly no, no reason to panic and no reason to think that this is going to necessarily turn into a major outbreak. Health experts still aren't sure how humans are being infected. The coronavirus is most closely related to a bat virus, and scientists are considering whether bats or other animals like goats or camels are a possible source of infection. An expert tells ABC at this stage the virus is unpredictable. Is it in fact going to uh, really just die out? Is it going to just have these sporadic occasional infections occur? Or is it going to actually blow, as we would say, and develop the ability to be transmitted by humans to humans? The World Health Organization says the virus is probably more widespread than just the Middle East and has advised health workers to test anyone with unexplained pneumonia. For Newsy, I'm Zach Toombs. Multiple sources, a real story.